What's up guys, my name is Ace, and today we're going to be breaking down the Ping Exo ability in Advanced Warfare, and we'll also be taking a look at what counters the Ping Exo ability. Let's get into it. Alright guys, so the description for the Exo Ping ability didn't really make a whole lot of sense to me at first. It doesn't really clearly explain what it does. Uh, basically the description says, show enemy Exo movement and weapons fire in your heads up display. Now at first glance, to me, that sounded like they would be popping up on the minimap because that's part of your heads-up display, but that's not the case. What actually happens is they pop up through walls, like the uh, threat detection uh, module that you can add on a UAV, or I believe it's the threat enhancer site, something like that. They basically glow red through walls, and I will give you an example here in a second. So as you can see, when the XO ping ability is activated, you can see your enemy through the wall as he's dashing and jumping around, uh, and it'll also display him if he's shooting an unsilenced weapon. As for the ways to counter the ping ability, I was really surprised by this. I thought it was going to be cold-blooded that would counter this, but cold-blooded doesn't actually counter this. The only two perks that counter this are low profile and blast suppressor. And another really interesting fact with this is if you're using low profile and you shoot an unsilenced weapon, you will still not show up with XO ping. But when you're using blast suppressor, if you fire an unsilenced weapon, you will show up, but your EXO movements won't show up. So it's really uh, interesting, really kind of complex. I didn't think there'd be that much complexity behind the counters. But just to restate that, if you're using low profile, you will never show up with EXO ping, even if you're shooting an unsilenced weapon. With blast suppressor, your movements will never show up on an EXO ping. But if you are firing an unsilenced weapon, you will still show up. As for the duration of this EXO ability, it lasts for 6 seconds without the overcharge perk, and it lasts for just over 7 seconds with the overcharge perk equipped. As for the range of XO ping, I actually kind of thought this was going to be like a close range only thing, but the range seems to be infinite from what I could test. As you can see here, I can see my enemy from across the map Detroit with no issues using the XO ping ability. So overall, my thoughts on the XO ping ability is at this point in the game's life cycle, it's probably not going to be very useful for you, simply because most people are using either Blast Suppressor or Low Profile, and if they're using either one of those perks, they are not going to show up at all on your XO ping. So at this point in the game's life cycle, with the way that people are building their classes, I wouldn't recommend it. Maybe down the road, people are going to start straying away from Blast Suppressor and Low Profile, and it'll become more useful. But at this point, I wouldn't really recommend it. So that's going to wrap it up for today's video. Let me know in the comment section below which one of the EXO abilities you'd like to see me cover next. If you enjoyed the video, a like rating is always appreciated, and don't forget to subscribe for more if you haven't already. I'll talk to you guys next time.